So now as a bonus, I wanted to share even more wrist exercises to help you out. You can combine them, make your own routines, and practice your own things. These are just for more ideas and other methods I found and created myself that I want to share with you. So first one I would say is get in a plate like this, any weighted plate. Not too heavy that you can grip, man. What you will do is you grip it with your fingertips like such, and then you would move it around in a circle. Now it also works your shoulder a bit, but the thing is, instead of just holding it, when you cause motion, it forces you to grip it tighter so it doesn't fall off, see? So when you move it around, you have to grip it tighter to make sure it doesn't fall off. So when you're doing this, it really works that grip, it's like doing a row. Then reverse. So that's first exercise. You can just bring it up any way you like. So you see, very simple. All right, second exercise is not really necessary in terms of you don't have to buy this, but if you do, it's also a good investment. And I got it on sale a long time ago called Iron Arms. Pretty much it works the twisting motion, the inner and outer forearm. So it's pretty decent. Hopefully you can see it work. You grip it like this, this is how it looks like. And then you turn inside out. So it works the same thing we did with the hammer. So this is a nice way because you don't need a hammer and you can work two at one. It slides under the bed, it's pretty easy access. Put it in your backpack if you go on a trip. So it's a nice addition to your uh, home gym. Pretty much you do this, maybe 20 reps, one side, you just flip it over. Now you got the other side. Also, due to the contraction, this works a little bit for the bicep, surprisingly. But it's also a nice, really calorie burn. A nice way to help your forearms. So that's another cool tool you can use. Now, uh, let me get out a really awesome one right here. So the last uh, wrist exercise I want to share with you in this video is simply using a backpack. Now, backpacks on their own are really great training utensil for multiple muscle joints, like I showed you in previous videos. But today we're going to focus on the forearms inner and outer and also training this wrist if you've seen in another video where you can do wrist locks it's a really great way to make your wrist stronger so you can avoid and you know use for self-defense and today we're just going to train them so you get a simple backpack like this it doesn't really matter with backpack of course you can fill it with books you can fill it with weights so let's add more weight And what you would do is you would grip it like this. Hopefully you can see. Usually you put it on a desk so your arm is flat and you're just working the wrist. I'll just use this for support, but what you're going to do is this. You bring it up. And trust me, this is going to burn. Try to go for high reps. Now what I find is this is more effective than using like a dumbbell. More effective and more comfortable. Then, of course, you can switch it to work the inner part. Like a curl, except you're not curling your whole arm. Your arm stays straight. You're just turning at the wrist. And that's about it, guys. So I'm going to give you a little list below how many reps to do about. You can do this nice little workout. Like I said, Right before you go to sleep, find about 5-10 minutes in your day and just go for it. And overall, your wrist should increase in strength and become more durable. So, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.